Epic Rap Battles of Half-Life! Mitchell Shepard versus Aiden Walker! Here's the story of Little Mitchell Shepard as if his little story would even matter. Fought in Black Mesa, then a guy dressed as Freeman served his ass to him on a silver platter. Made a deal to save his life, but the same deal only made his entire situation worse. And then the absolute buffoon swore he'd get his revenge on the completely wrong person. Ran away from a seven hour war, and then he made some boring new friends along the way. Spent 20 years at sea after he stole a boat and some little boys too because he's kinda gay. The G-Man had to remind him of his promise because the stupid plot line made him forget it. Then our hero saw the strings on his back as he was being dragged along. Just like a puppet. You're talking to a villain, my friend. The hero in me died way back when I was young. You couldn't save your daughter, yet you want to diss me for saving a factory full of innocent children? Really, our stories are the same, except in yours you got your balls taken off by a spoon. How could you claim to still have your faculties when you got tricked by someone like Barty Calhoun? It's quite a shame because you're such a good soldier and your talent is completely gone to waste, when all you ever seem to want to do is lay down and give the old Combine's boots a taste. I'm all original while clones of you are shot out into the world like a douchebag shooting machine gun, and that's exactly the reason why you're number three. 650 and the reason why I am number one. Hold on a second, hate to interrupt you, but what you were about to say is just not true. I may be a clone and half synthetic, but I've got a thousand times more personality than you do. Our stories may be similar, but that doesn't mean that you come slightly close to being my equal. Your game's a shitty, glitchy mess, and everyone knows my game is the real opposing force sequel. Yeah, I'm loyal to the combine. My boss is an entire empire that stretches far. I picked the winning side, yet your boss is none other than President Keemstar. Let me just say one more thing, and I don't think I can possibly make it any more clear. You see, this is a word battle I see this as the easiest promotion of my career. See, that's just the thing, man. You're always kissing ass in an effort to get to the top. Maybe that's why your co-workers hate you and why your only friend is a naked obsolete robot. My last name is Shepard because I'm a leader, a total badass, and a real champion. You're nothing but a mouthy, mass-produced, chain-smoking, sounding cyclotic tampon. And don't say that your games have anything to do with opposing force when Adrian is my brother. And don't come back for Entropy 03 or more of your boring story will have to be suffered. And don't think I'll forgive you for that interruption earlier. Just one more thing before I say goodbye. You you fucked up my diss, and now you have my permission to die. Don't think that this battle's over, so you better sit your edgy ass back down and listen. Nobody talks to my boss like that without getting roasted to death by his boy Wilson. Couldn't find Freeman after 20 years, but boss found Mossman in a day even with a clone on his ass. Your ending teased Borealis, but he found it while barely even looking for it, and that's just a fact. Like you said, I'm his only friend, but I'm all he needs, cause together we're the absolute best. Our games are free while your game's not, even though you'd have to pay people to play that mess. Your dev stole assets like how the Combine went and stole the Earth's natural resources. No wonder humanity lost the war when they let Geralt cosplayers into the armed forces. Come on, Aiden, you had to sick your robot buddy on me like you think that could possibly defeat me. The same one who calls me a cosplayer but tries and fails to be half as charming as Wheatley. Make fun of my game like you really think that yours are so deserving of a brag? I seem to recall Entropy Zero One's puzzles being a complete and utter drag. Yeah, my game costs money, and guess what? It's worth every single cent for it. Maybe if he made some dough, he could hire a therapist so he could cry and vent a bit. I may be edgy, but your boss is so beyond the edge he fell off a cliff. They call him bad cop, but really, they should call him the shit sheriff. Who won? Who's next? You decide!